Hey, what's up guys? So playing that deck, that is amazing. Uh, I think I'm gonna open up with this, because uh, I don't like drawing either one of these really early on. Um, I just don't find it too useful. When there's a lot of other things I can go for. Um, so, I'm gonna get to draw. One, two, and three. Oh, that's cool. I don't want this card again. <laughs> this card doesn't understand. I don't want to draw it. I like this card. This card's too good. Maria Reed. Especially since now water has so much support. It's much more viable. Um, so yeah, it, it, it's a pretty good card. It's not a plus, not it's not a minus. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Well, why is this mermaid always going to my hand? Uh, let's see. We've got first turn Android. I really like first turn Android. It's good. I like it a lot. Um, I could have technically activated the last Maria of Greed. Uh, see if this effect goes off. Because if not, I'll be kind of sad. Poor D.Va by herself is not very strong. Uh, we get the effect. Uh, I'm going to assume that's okay. Alright, so we're going to go for Poiming. First turn Android, as always, because why not? It's so good. Um, do I want to set anything to bluff? I mean, I feel like all these cards are too good. I have Salvage, yes. Yeah, just... Oh, I, I actually got an idea. I can, I got this, I got this. Check this out, guys. Um, we can add these back to our hand. And then Mariah Greed again. <laughs> Mariah Greed is just way too good. It really is. Because look, we can cycle our our hand again, because I don't really want these. <laughs> I want D.Va, though. Alright, there we go. One, two, three. Oh, I guess Solemn Judgment, I guess. Alright, so, I'm looking pretty good right now. I have a lot of good cards inside. Oh. No, you can't have that. No bunny for you. You can't have that. Oh, Torrential. There's, there's a lot of good cards. Um, I, I don't mind. Let's get Torrential. Oh, Solomon. Okay. Oh, okay. He's already, he's already got the damage going. Alright, so... We gained 600 now. There we go. That's the end of it for me. Torgain. So go for Torgain's hand, I guess. That doesn't bother me at all. He can have his effect. Because I'm going to go for Torgain's hand again. And then once he goes for his summon rabbit, we'll just be like, oh, it's called Torrential. <laughs> okay. So that's completely fine. No problem. Oh, he's just going to go for a quick overlay. Okay. Let's see what he goes for. Um, number 17? Oh, uh, Zimmings in defense mode. I, that, in that case, I don't want a Torrential Tribute. Um, however, I still have answers because Deep Sea Diva is just too good. Um, so, that usually will reveal that his back row is not too good. Uh, let's see if that's good. Okay, so he says it's good. And we can go for um, Point Man again because I don't really like drawing him. And then we can uh, go for a Catastor. And as you guys know, Catastor, um, he will detach two, essentially. So, because he wants, he, first he destroys it. Um, so, yeah. Um, because Catastor not only. Uh, you know, actually attacks him through because once he detaches, the attack finally goes through. So yeah, that's something important. If you really want to get rid of that, you have to have, and Android will finally finish the card off.
because if Catastro attacks anything that's not dark, it destroys it without damage calculation. Um, maybe I have to. I, I wish I could like explain it to him a little bit better. I'm trying to think of how you could explain it to him better in text. Um, He has to detach too. <laughs> and then Android will finish this off. Maybe he was looking it up. And at the moment, I would really hate to get Dark Hole, but if he has Dark Hole, he's got Dark Hole. I can't really respond to that. Um, but I feel like I, I'm in a pretty good spot already. Um, yeah. And I have another Diva, <clears throat> and I have Tour Guide. Like, I have a lot of good stuff. Like, he'll have to go for <clears throat> Dolka, and even Dolka won't be, like, too great at the moment. And I know this card is bad because of um, him uh, going for his own mains. I know I could use D.Va, but I don't feel like D.Va is necessary at the moment. Um, I could have... Reborn... No, there's nothing really too good. He could Reborn Rabbit. <laughs> Yeah, and as you guys can see, it's oh, he had Cobazoles. And so, like, this card would be able to get me another card, and that would be game. And that's just how Dino Rabbit is. Like, I really feel like you have to go first uh, in Dino Rabbit because, like, you have to get your first negates out. And because I had Solemn Judgment, and I ended up getting a whole bunch of life after that, so. Um, I think that this deck can have an effect against the meta, and again, it's just going first in Yu-Gi-Oh, it really does set up yourself for advantage. So, uh, there's the deck. I mean, every turn is you can make a sync, and it's pretty good for that. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, I mean, let me know what you guys think of the, the deck matchups against the meta, if you guys have played this deck. I think this deck has some potential, though. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. Asian Ice White Dragon, signing out.